this week with a game in Pearl and then a home series? Uh, we got four big games this week. Uh, you know, four ranked teams we got to play. Uh, you know, I mean, we all know who we got tomorrow, and then this weekend we got a very good Georgia team. We're going to take one game at a time. Um, we just got to have a good practice today and kind of get things rolling again. What are your emotions? Probably, well, I guess I mean, you could get drafted by the race, play in your hometown again, I guess. But last time as a Mississippi State player, I guess, playing in your hometown, does that still mean a lot to you? Yeah, absolutely. You know, uh, it's it's always awesome playing in Pearl. You know, kind of right, right in my backyard. Uh, you know, I have a lot of family there. Um, it's just going to be a fun night, you know. Uh, a lot of old friends and family will be there. So just going to enjoy it and have some fun. How different is that game compared to just a normal midweek game that you, you, you guys usually play? You know, it, it, it definitely means something uh, a lot different than other games. You know, uh, there's some bragging rights in the state. Um, I mean, it, it's the Governor's Cup, so let's, let's roll. Is it kind of a good thing that it's this game comes at this time after this past weekend? I mean, it's pretty. it seems like it might be pretty easy to get right, right back locked in. Yeah, absolutely. You know, uh, it, you know it's uh, a quick turnaround for sure after a rough weekend in Arkansas. But, you know, we'll I – mean, we got 12 more SEC games on the weekend. Uh, we're 10 and 8 right now. So I mean, you know, we, we kind of control our, you know, fate postseason wise. You know, if we still want to be a national seed, we can do that. If we want to be a regional host, we can do that. You know, we control, you know, what we can control. And uh, what does that mean? That means let's go out here today and have a good practice. Uh, it's very important we do that. You know, uh, get the offense rolling again. You know, but all year we've hit well. You know, pretty much all year we've pitched well, so uh, this is the first kind of rut we've had at the plate a little bit, and, and, and it's surprising it's taken this long. Um, there's no need to overthink it. Just get out there today, you know, hit some balls around the yard and kind of get everybody's swing back to normal and, um, and get locked in mentally. You've been in this situation several times in your career where a talented team just hits a rut in the road. What, what's the pulse of this team? What does this team need to, to get back to what it usually is? Well, I mean, you know, like I said, we're 10 and 8 right now. You know, uh, we've been in much worse situations in my four years here. There's no doubt about that. The uh, 2016 team was, uh, you know, arguably one of the most talented teams. I think in, you know, five, 10 years, you're going to look back and be like, oh my gosh, that, there's a lot of big leaguers on that team. And, uh, and uh, we left Tuscaloosa. No, excuse me. We went into Game Three in Tuscaloosa, 11 and 10 that year, and uh, we finished up 21 and 10. So you know, it's uh, you know, talent can only take you so far. It's how well you play together. And uh, you know, this weekend we just didn't play well, and yeah, we didn't play well last midweek too. So we kind of had. You know, it was just a bad week. We had four four games that we weren't really right at the plate. Uh, you know, pitching didn't do what they did normally, and, and we're fine. There, there's no need to panic. There's no need for anything except just come out here and have a good practice. We're closing in on the hits record now. Will it almost feel like a weight off your shoulders once you finally get that and get that past you? Just want to win. I can care less about it, to be honest with you. You know, it, it's always on your head and in your mind a little bit. Just you know, you know, with how social media works nowadays, and it, it's it's tough not to think about, but. I promise you, I would have rather gone over for the weekend and swept Arkansas than gotten 10 hits and, and got swept. It, hate losing. We all hate losing. It, you know, it kind of leaves a bad taste in your mouth, but we got to move on from it. And the hits will come if they come. You know, if I just if I swing at strikes and uh, you know not chase bad pitching, the hits will come. It, you know, it, hits hits aren't controllable, but how how good you're at bats, all you can control.